Hey there everybody, it's Adam Tereska again. What's happening? Well, with my love of older cars, I decided to do a thing, and I bought myself one. This 1979 Ford Thunderbird. This is gonna be another project that we have on top of the 64 Harley-Davidson project we have going on. And we're also gonna be working on this one as well. It's a 1979 Ford Thunderbird. It's got under 72,000 original miles. It's got a 302 with a C4, 9-inch Ford rear end. And it was a family heirloom from the family from whom I bought it. The car is a, it was a grandmother and grandfather who owned the car. They bought it brand new out the showroom floor. And now that I have it, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to get it all fixed up. I'm going to get it mechanically sound, do the body and paint. And this thing's going to be a beautiful, beautiful piece when we get done. Give me a shot of the interior of the car. This other side from one spot on the passenger seat, the seats in this thing are absolutely beautiful. Let me get that. There we go. There's absolutely no damage to the interior in this car whatsoever. The carpeting is all nice. And the headliner is undamaged as well. Now, the vinyl top is ruined, but that's okay. I'm going to take the vinyl top off it anyway and repaint it. Here is the distinctive look of the rear of a 1979 Thunderbird with the single backup light in the middle and the two huge taillights on each side. I absolutely love these cars. And this is going to be a fun project to put back on the street. And once I get done with her, we're going to go back to the family who we bought it from and we're going to show them the car. I let them see what we did with it. Now the air cleaner is in the trunk right now, but we are working on getting it to start up. We did learn it's going to need a fuel. Looks like either going to blow out the fuel system and see if that helps. If not, we're going to have to put a fuel pump on it, which is not a big deal. It's only about thirty bucks for the part, and we'll be able to put it on in less than an hour. But yeah, this thing is real solid foundation and I'm really looking forward to uh, putting this car back together again and redoing it. And as we put the car back together again, I will be doing videos on this as I will be with the 1964 Harley Davidson Dual Glide. So, I wanted to give you a brief update what we got going on, get a quick video out here for you guys since I've been so busy with everything else going on in life, I just have not had a chance to do other stuff that I need to do and make more videos. So, with that, we're going to bid adieu for now, and we'll catch you in the next video. Have a great day, everybody.